All right, good morning, guys. October 10th, about about 8.30 in the morning. And check this out. I've been, it's been like five days with increased calories and my weight's still going down. Yesterday was 67 and today I broke back into 66s, 66.9. And like I haven't even been following, like I, I plan to have 2,400, 2,420 calories a day, but I've probably been going to like around 2,500 or something, and my weight is still dropping. That's pretty, that's pretty crazy, man. So, it should stop dropping pretty soon, because it went from 69.65 all the way down to 66.9. Of course, the beginning was just because I was like, I stuffed myself that one day, but it's just kind of amazing to see that, uh, it's still dropping. So, um, yeah, so today is a Saturday, and I'm still up early because I'm about to leave, actually. Actually, today I'm playing uh, tennis with the lady that I play with sometimes. She's like an older lady, so, you know, she's not, like, amazing beastly, but, you know, it still lets me get out there and play, and I haven't played in a long time um, since the last time, so I'll probably record some of myself uh, playing some tennis today. You can see... See me do some athletic activity. You guys see me do like Diablo, but yeah, like before I got into, before I was into, ever into this bodybuilding thing, you know, I was into Diablo and tennis. So you guys can see me play some tennis. I used to play a lot, um, you know, like be competitive, uh, but not anymore. I barely ever get to play, especially in Japan. So should be interesting. Oh man, it's like black. These are my actual tennis shoes. Whew. And my Rakatas. Mmm. So I'm gonna go outside now and uh, she's gonna pick me up and we're gonna go play some tennis. Hi, Moss. It's acting freezing out here. Holy crap. Oh. oh. There she is in a red car. You. All right, boys and girls. So we are here. We are here. 8:54 in the a.m. By the way. So this thing. You see this? Oh my! God. It's actually a pretty deep. It's like stabbed through here. So yesterday I was eating like my pancakes, right? I dropped my fork. I thought it would be a good idea to like slam my hand down on the fork to stop it and uh, I wasn't looking and the fork prong actually went from here all the way through and I didn't really, I was just like ow and then I looked down and the fork was just hanging from my hand stuck through my skin and I was like oh my god and it actually ended up being a pretty deep stab so that was pretty dumb of me next time I'm just gonna let the fork fall but I was really afraid the fork with like the peanut butter and crap would fall on the floor and get dirty so I ended up doing something stupid all right back on these sanded courts so guys like I said last time <laughs> I'm so freaking bad at moving on these sand courts cuz all my life I've played on those good old American hard courts where it's really easy to stop and turn and move but this stuff uh, kind of mimics clay and I'm so crap at moving on it oh man okay Okay, cool. Alright, gonna record a little bit. We just warmed up, and most of these balls are dead, so, uh... <laughs> Come 
If you're wondering, I'm wearing this beanie because my hair is too long. It's getting in my eyes. Right, after an hour, let's see how many calories we burned. <laughs> Ugh. Can I see? 50, 58 minutes. You probably can't see. 106 heart rate. 432 calories. Whoa. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, guys. So it is currently 1244. Tennis went pretty well. It was pretty fun. And I just finished eating lunch. So now. As you saw, my hair is like, well, as you can see, my hair is pretty effing long, and when I was playing tennis, it kept like getting in my eye, and it'll like, it'll like stab my eye, so it was really annoying. So actually right now, I'm gonna go and try to get myself a Dolce haircut. All right, guys, so. All right, guys, so, my Dolce haircut is done. Can you, uh, sliding's messed up, but. Yeah, this is my Dolce haircut. Maybe it'll look better out here. Maybe it'll look better out here. Does it look any better? I don't know. But anyways, I got my haircut finally. It's not my eyes anymore. Feels good. Feels great. And if you're wondering why I call it a Dolce haircut, it's because the place is called Dolce. <laughs> yeah, so feel good. So I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna. I'm gonna drink a smoothie, a protein smoothie. Take a quick little nap, and then I'm gonna go to the gym. So today will be the last day of the um. The six-day split, it's the last 
you know, working day. So I'm pretty excited. All right, guys, it is 4.20 now. Just got to the training room, so I'm about to do this workout. So now I think you can see the hair a lot clearly, more clearly in here, and uh, just to want to get a public poll, what do you think's better? Do you think it looks better when I have long hair, or do you prefer, or do you think it looks better when I have short hair, like, like something like this? Put your comments down below. I'm very curious, actually. I, I do like long hair, but before it was too long, and when it gets long, even when it looks like decent, I get annoyed just because it's like kind of in my face and I feel it, and it's just, I don't know, it just gets tedious. This is a lot easier for me. Going a little lighter on the rack pulls for today. I think rack pulls is like one of the best overall like thickness exercises to really bring up your whole back because you know you gotta work the lower back and your just like posterior chain when you're coming up and then at the top of the motion when you like really squeeze everything in the back it works like your traps your upper back everything so this is a great movement but my lower back is still kind of feeling a little weird so I'm lowering the weight to just 297 pounds or 135 kilos which is not that bad for me normally I do like at least 330 pounds and I can hit that for eight Alright guys, how are you doing? It's been a while since I've done a commentary, but I kind of want to explain what I'm doing here. So in the past few videos you've seen me doing some posing and the reason why I keep doing like this back posing, this is like the second video, maybe third video in a row where I'm doing back posing. And uh, first of all, notice the Christmas tree action, holy moly. Like I I'm, this is, this is like a week into giving myself more calories. I've been eating more and I've actually been going over the amount of calories that I allotted myself. And yet I look lean as hell. So I'm looking pretty good even though I'm transition slowly transitioning into a bulk. I think the uh, extra calories is actually doing me very well. It's giving me more energy so I can actually burn more calories by doing, you know, more activity, like going harder in the gym, doing other activity. Now anyways, Back to why I keep doing this back posing. So I am actually, I'm just really bad at doing the back poses. As you can, like the first videos where I was doing back poses, it, it felt so awkward for me. Like this pose especially is the hardest one for me. The other ones, the, the width, the little physique width back pose is not too bad, but this back double bicep is so difficult for me. Um, every time I do it, I, I when I was doing it before, I always would like crunch my back on accident because I thought that's what it's supposed to look like. But then your back looks very narrow and it just looks weird. Now it's getting better as you can see. See, first when I bring my arms down, the back is like crunched. But then I spread it out and really I'm, I'm trying to focus on, you know, displaying all the muscles as you can see. There's so many muscles in the back and when you do this pose, you should be able to see all of them. Or you should be able to see, yeah, pretty much all of them and it's supposed to show you know your width so right there it's crunched and then look I bring it out and there so I, I'm just really just practicing this pose to try to better it for myself because I want to have the same pose for whenever I take progress pictures Jeez, guys this is ridiculous I'm not even in a surplus yet uh, calorie wise but just giving myself more calories I feel like amazing I don't feel I don't feel like exhausted at all I just feel like ready to work out ready to make legains oh my goodness <laughs> 